Hi, I'm Jenna with Chief Architect. In this video segment, I'm going to show the new 3D rendering features in Chief Architect X9. We've really added a lot of features in this category, so let's jump in and take a look at the new enhancements. Rendering in X9 is now significantly faster with improved quality. For example, you will notice the speed improvements when using watercolor and the sketched line drawing. They are nearly as fast to generate as the other rendering techniques. Further, with shadows turned on, you will find 3D navigation and responsiveness are the same as if they were off. The rendering results continue to get more realistic without the need to ray trace. New render features that make this possible are ambient occlusion, bloom, bump maps, and normal maps. All new optional elements you can add in rendered views. Normal maps are new in X9. For material definitions, they add depth and realism for rendered and ray traced views. You can see in this scene the difference when a material includes normal maps. All of the core Chief Architect library materials have been updated in this release to include normal maps. Perspective cameras can now be duplicated to precisely replicate angle, direction, and other camera attributes. If you have the perfect camera angle in a plan, you can copy that camera up a floor or to another plan. 360 degree spherical rendering in Ray Trace is now part of Chief Architect X9. In Render, you can export the 360 image, and in Ray Trace, there is an option to generate a 360 image. The panorama images can be saved to your Chief Architect Cloud account with an option to share via email or embed them on your website that will include a new Chief Architect 360 viewer so visitors see your profile in a more immersive view. The 360 images can be viewed using the Google Cardboard glasses, and the images can be uploaded to Facebook and other social media sites.